Welcome Duelists, we are going to do an unboxing today of The Legendary Duelist Season 3. I am recently getting back into Yu-Gi-Oh, so I'm sorry if I mispronounce anything or don't exactly know what I'm looking for. But, we are sponsored today by Ken's Comic Man, so give them a shout out. All of these cards will be available at your local Ken's Comic Man. So we're going to dive right into it. I don't have a super abundance of time, but let's try to enjoy ourselves while we're doing this. If you guys have any questions, please call or message us on Facebook. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. Or you can message me, Jaden Morgan, if you know me personally, or get a hold of Steve and he'll get you my information. Just let me know who you are and... We'll try to answer any questions you have the best we can. So, today's box comes with eight smaller boxes. I'm not exactly sure what's in them. I don't, I'm not really a big fan of spoilers, so if you're like me, we're all in this surprise together. But, so, we're going to have fun. We're going to open them one at a time, enjoy ourselves. Uh, I'm going to try to keep the dice to where you guys can see them. Because I do know that they come with dice. And from what I've heard, I don't know if it's true. There is a secret dice with a different art than these five here pictured. But if it's true, let me know. And we'll see if we can pull one. If you guys have any suggestions on like products I should open. Whether it be Magic, Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, Digimon, Flesh and Blood, any of those, just let me know, and I will do the best I can. Let's see, we got, I don't know if you guys can see that very well. Uh, trying this on a new camera setup, I've never actually done this before, which, I don't know who that is, if you guys know, let me know, because it looks kind of weird. But, that's our first one. So I think this is our secret rare. Yeah. I'll go ahead and open that so you guys can see it. And then I think it comes with two packs. Get a little close up. So you guys can read that. Uh, pause it if you need to. Um. We're in no rush today. Oh man, these are some big packs. Holy crap. Comes with 18 cards. I guess it's not really all too big. But. Camera keeps unfocusing for some reason. Maybe if I bring it closer. Ah, there we go. Where is this? Okay, I think it's the glare that's messing my camera up. Hopefully, I'll be getting a better camera here soon. Maybe if I hold them more flat. Yes, we did start this pack over because the glare was messing it up real bad and I want to make sure everybody can see everything all right and nobody's left out. All right, that was our first pack. Now we're going on to our second pack. Uh, these are about $16 after tax, which I forgot to tell you guys. They're a dollar more for some reason than the last ones. I'm not exactly sure why. But I'm sure if you guys ask Steve or your local, con local card shop, they will be able to explain why. I just personally don't know. A 
lot of reprints in this set from what I've heard. I'm not exactly 100%. I'm seeing a couple that was around when I was playing, which was, I think, I think, I can't remember quite right. I think I quit right before Lynx became a thing. And it was all very confusing for me, but a couple of my friends convinced me to get back in the game, so here I am. Spending way more money than I should be. <laughs> Ooh, got the red one this time. Which one is that one? That one's the Destiny Heroes, I think. Maybe it's the Elemental Heroes. I don't remember. Alright, so our secret rare is a Yu Gi Oh card. Haha! <laughs> it's the Cursed Necrofear. Looks pretty neat. I don't know how likely it'll be to see play, but I guess we'll all see eventually. Oh, this one was upside down. Oh, another Dark Magician girl. Well, it's not too bad, I don't think. Just who knows, maybe we'll get something that's just super expensive or super good. These packs just don't know. I'm opening them upside down. That's why they're upside down. Why didn't you guys tell me? <laughs> Uh, we are playing a tournament here tonight if you guys are interested. Uh, Buy-ins are free. Just kind of playing to have fun. You guys should come up. Let's see what all the fuss is about. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, it's the red one. These are also coming in different colors of the name. I don't remember what all colors they are. I know there's red, blue, and I think purple. I conveniently think the red one is most expensive. I can't really remember. I don't remember how much they said they were going for. But we're on box three of eight. We'll all see how this goes. Hopefully, we get some cool dice. Kind of want the Dark Magician Circle, or the Dark Magic Circle, and the Dark Magician ones are the ones I'm most excited for. Ooh, I think we got a Dark Circle one. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Yeah. And then let's see what our secret rare is, guys. Ta-da! Soul Servant in the Secret Rare. Well, guys, I really should have brought a trash can. That's what I should have done. But hey, I know for next time. The secret rares are guaranteed one per box, which I'm sorry, I, I forgot that part. Uh, I'll read the back of the box and tell you guys what all it gar well, guarantees to a point. It, they all come with, well, I'll let you guys read them. They come with two season three packs, each containing 15 commons and three ultras one of ten secret rares 
and one of several collectible dice. So we've got that one, that one, and that one. We just got two more. Two more and we'll have all of them. Which, do you guys know if the dice are actually ever worth anything? Or is it just one of those that they're just kind of there to enjoy? Let me know. I'm kind of curious. Another Ebon High Magician. Hey, there we go. I don't know if he's worth anything. Another Starving Venom. Is that a... No, that's a comic. On to our next box. Oh. Sorry guys. So all I did was pull the soul servant out. I'm gonna try and keep track of which secret rares we have and which secret rares we don't. <laughs> but hopefully I get most of them, if not all of them. Sorry if that was really loud guys, my phone went off. We just updated the Facebook page to let everybody know that these were in stock. Along with a bunch of other stuff. We got some new Pokemon in. We got some, uh, I think we got some new manga in. A whole bunch of other stuff. Oh, the dice is hiding from us. Oh, hey, we got the Dark Magician. Yeah. And we got the Liquid Soldier. I don't know what he does, I'm sorry. I'll open him here in just one second. I wanna get through these packs first. Uh, thank you guys for coming by, supporting us. We really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Ooh, more magician stuff, I don't know. Earthbound, are Earthbound's making a comeback or something? Or am I just, or did they just need some filler stuff and that's all they had left. Because there's a lot of Earthbound stuff in here. Ooh, this one's got the gold name. We've been getting the blue ones. Oh, sorry about that. There we go. Well, I thought my ring light was going to help with the whole... Uh, the glare thing, but apparently not. But, I'll get a better one. That's no big deal. Sorry for the long video also. I didn't think it would take this long. I, uh oh. Oh, yeah. But, I'm just enjoying myself here. You guys should be enjoying yourself. And remember, all of these are available at your local shop. You can buy these for uh, roughly about $16 after tax or so. The full case like I bought is a hundred and twenty eight dollars. I think it was. I don't remember. I try not to remember spending money. It hurts me. But you can come and pick some singles up if you want from Ken's Comic Man or you can just buy packs and try to get the collectible dice like I am. I'm a nerd for collectible stuff and well this just seemed like a really good time to buy some new Yu-Gi-Oh products to do some videos on don't get a whole lot of oh is that the last one <sighs> that's the last one so bought a case and got all five of the collectible dice now maybe if we can just hold that oh yeah I forgot to Open the liquid soldier for you guys. Sorry about that. It's my first time ever doing a info video. Let me know how I did. I I appreciate the feedback. Anything you guys can tell me will help for the next time to make the videos better or longer. Even if you guys want 
Oh, I just hit my camera. So sorry about that. Ooh, we got the Dark Magicians as the secret rare. I don't even know what all secret rares there are. But apparently the Magicians needed some reprints. Did they need reprints, guys? Like I said, I'm I'm relatively renewed to the game. I'm just getting back into it after a four, almost five year hiatus. I miss the community. I miss my friend. Miss the friends that played it. So a lot of them still play it, which is really good. Some of them don't, which you know, you win some, you lose some. But I would love to play against any one of you. As long as you play to have fun anyway. Or play to lose. I don't I don't mind. I'll play to have fun. I also like hearing stories about how you guys played. Like what's the funniest thing that you guys have had happen to you in a game? Wow, that's an old card. Looks like the Autobots are getting a reprint too. I don't know what any of this is. <laughs> If I'm getting anything good, guys, please tell me. I don't know. These boxes are conveniently, like, trash can sized. <laughs> like, you can fit uh, shoving all of the same trash in the one box. Oh, we got another Dark Magician dice. Nice. About to have to make a new trash box, everybody. Trash box getting full. Who's this? Kaiser Glider Golden Burst. What the heck is that? Oh my god, what are these packs made out of? Wow, oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Name sounds familiar. That's a cheap blue eyes. Oh, another dark magician thingy. Another one of those guys. Another spirit message. A destiny board. Satellite Synchron. Supreme King. Infernal Sniper. Ooh, I remember when these were so expensive. Jeez. Wonder how much they are now. Let me know in the comments how much Apprentice Illusion Magician is. Dark magician girl again that's like our third one I think if I'm moving too fast guys please let me know so in the next video I can slow it down a little bit I appreciate it I've got two more boxes left after this one guys and then I'll be out of here off to another adventure Oh my god, that's that's a really odd colored picture. Ah, stupid camera. 
guys that have any camera suggestions, you can leave those down below too. Huh? I appreciate it. Another one. Oh my gosh. And the reason I'm not reading over all these guys is I feel like they're all reprints. I feel like these have all been a thing already. But uh, for future sets, if they're new cards, I will read over them. Review them and kind of give you my opinion on them. Which I'm kind of glad I'm not doing that right now seeing it is I'm, I'm getting back into it and I just... I feel like I would be giving the wrong opinion a lot. And I, I don't like giving the wrong opinion. I don't like giving people the wrong idea. Oh. But, got our two boxes left. That means four packs, two secret rares, two dice. Really hope we get that secret dice that I was hearing about like don't quote me on it but I'm pretty sure somebody said there was a secret one that I don't even know like if it's true because here's another dark magic circle it gives me two of each dark magician one that's our secret right can we sneak a peek I can't I can't read it not like that anyway ready ta-da oh harpies pet dragon fearsome fire blast huh. pretty neat secret rares don't look too bad today i almost lost the pack guys and they're sitting right in front of me Another one, that's three. Is that one a different color? I don't know. A big old hefty stack of cards there. box after this guys hope it's got some good stuff some really light jaw dropping good stuff if not oh well it's classics Oh my god, the cards are bent. So be careful guys, because I've noticed it a couple times. I just, I thought it was me bending them, but yeah, look at that. Be careful of how you open these packs. They're dangerous. Wish you guys would have given me a heads up. <laughs> I'm just joking. Because I'm not in it for the money. I'm in it for the fun. Alright, secret dice, hopefully. Probably not. I really feel like it was a hoax just to get me to buy this. I really do. But, that's what you get for reading stuff on the internet. Is it? Is it? Oh, no, it's another Dark Magician. Oh! It's not Dark Magician, it's the Honest, Honest Neos, I think it was. I don't know. I didn't even get to see what our secret rare was before I dropped everything. 
Oh, it's another Dark Magician. Uh, I really wish it would have been a different one. Get a variety and not the same thing over and over. No, I'm just kidding. I like the Dark Magicians. They seem like they're pretty a pretty solid deck. How's it doing in the meta, guys? Is it still being played or is it non-existent? Well, I say non-existent, but apparently somebody likes them where they wouldn't keep reprinting Dark Magician and Dark Magician. Girl. Actually, that's one card we haven't seen in here yet, which is kind of surprising. See all the other Dark Magician stuff, but not the Dark Magician. Speaking of Dark Magician. Another one. And another one. I've been holding a secret out on you guys that I will explain here in just one moment after we get done looking at these. Alright guys, so, with all of these, and all the extra dice, I'm going to keep one of each dice, which, now that I think about it, isn't really a whole lot for you guys, <laughs> and I'm going to donate the rest to Ken's Comic Man for letting me uh, buy this, and being such a great person and such a great shop, uh, you guys should really check him out. Which hopefully I'll be able to talk to the other shop, see if they can, well, can. I'll buy something from there and do a video for them too. You never know. But uh, come down to Ken's Comic Man. You can pick up one of these. So unfortunately, that's all the extra ones I have is a Dark Magician, a Dark Magic Circle, and a Neos. And uh, most of these... Um, not really sure on what I'm going to keep out of it before I donate it. But you guys come down, see what I see what he has. He's got a bunch of stuff. Until next time, guys. Keep up the good work.